Hi everyone! In this short video, we're going to talk about special values of a polynomial function. They're called extrema. We already observed and talked about how graphs of polynomial functions have turning points. That's where the graph changes its direction from increasing to decreasing or vice versa. Turning points can be put in two different groups. Maximum points, that's where the graph forms a peak. And the turning points that we call minimum, because at those points, graph changes its direction from decreasing to increasing and forms a volley. But that's not all. Among minimum and maximum points, there can be absolute minimum and absolute maximum points. For example, this point here is the absolute minimum point, because it's the lowest point of the graph. And it corresponds to the smallest value of the function. Looks like in this case, it's negative 3. The absolute maximum is going to be the largest value of the function. Notice that neither this maximum or this one are the absolute maxima. Well, because they're not the largest values of the function. On this graph, notice how this end goes up. So function values are growing without bound. There is no largest value. Function value approaches positive infinity. And same thing here. This point does not represent the absolute maximum value of the function because both ends go up. And again, the function approaches infinity. Well, if the turning point is neither absolute minimum or absolute maximum, it's called local minimum or maximum. And observe that this turning point is a local minimum because the left end of the function goes down without bound means that function values will approach negative infinity. Despite that, every local maximum point and local minimum point will correspond to a certain function value. It looks like in this case local maximum equals 13, this local maximum equals about 3.5, and this local minimum equals negative 2. So basically, a graph of a polynomial function can have the absolute minimum and the absolute maximum value. And the rest of the function values that correspond to different turning points will be local maxima and local minima. By the way, maxima and minima, these are plural of maximum and minimum. And all of the special function values are called the extrema of a function. Please note that I've added notes here of what we talked about. This graph does not have the absolute maximum, and this graph here does not have any absolute extrema. No absolute maximum or no absolute minimum.